All the Python source code for this lesson is available for download. See video description. You will have the source code to create and draw the 3D artificial intelligence model that you see below. The drawings represent the internal structure, original data set, and testing the model with new data. The original data set is represented by circles and the new data with diamonds. Let us look at an example of a classification problem solved using Multilayer Perceptron, MLP. Multilayer Perceptron, MLP, is a type of artificial neural network made up of multiple layers of nodes in a directed graph. With each layer fully connected to the next one. Typically, MLP consists of three types of layers, an input layer, one or more hidden layers, and an output layer. The MLP adjusts the weights of the network during the training phase to improve the prediction or classification performance. In this example, we will use TensorFlow and Keras libraries to build an MLP model. To classify the samples in the IRIS dataset into one of three categories, see IRIS described below. First, we need to import the necessary libraries and load the dataset. This script begins by importing the required libraries, pre-processing the dataset, and splitting it into a training set and a test set. It then defines an MLP model with one hidden layer of eight nodes and an output layer of three nodes for the three classes. After that, it compiles the model and fits it to the training data. Then, it evaluates the model on the test data and prints the accuracy. Then it draws the internal representation of the model. Lastly, it draws a 3D chart with original points and with new points computed by the model. Prepare external libraries, so the following import will work. pip install scikit-learn. Scikit-learn, or sklearn, is one of the most widely used open-source machine learning libraries for Python. Scikit-learn supports both supervised and unsupervised learning and also Provides various tools for model fitting, data pre-processing, model selection, and evaluation. PIP install TensorFlow. TensorFlow is an open-source software library for high-performance numerical computation. Particularly well-suited to large-scale machine learning, a subset of artificial intelligence. PIP install Seaburn. Seaburn is a Python data visualization library based on Matplotlib. It provides a high-level interface for drawing attractive and informative statistical graphics. Import libraries. Load Iris dataset. The Iris Flower dataset is a popular dataset for machine learning and statistics. The dataset contains 150 samples from each of the three species of Iris flowers. The three categories are Iris setosa, Iris virginica, and Iris versicolor. Four features were measured, in centimeters, from each sample. Sepal length and width. Petal length and width. Convert integers to categories variables, i.e. one hot encoded. The data is transformed to an internal representation that is very simple to use by AI. i.e. labels equals 0, 1, 2, 1. 0, 0, 0, 1, 0. 0, 0, 1. Spoiler alert. The final prediction is transformed back to a human readable representation by NP, argmax. i.e., 0 0.1, 0 0.9, 0 0.2, class 1, where 0 0.1, 0 0.9, 0 0.2 are probabilities computed by AI model. The next step is to prepare the Artificial Intelligence Deep Learning MLP model. Play this animation on your computer by downloading the Python code. The second part of this movie is inside the next AI Deep Learning Python lesson. See links in the description of this video.